And so now we will have a discussion of a three religion, which is Judaism, Christianity, and the Islam. So the first one is Judaism. What is Judaism? Judaism with approximately 4,000 of years of history. Judaism is the world's oldest monastic religion. Judaism adherents believe one God who revealed himself to them through ancient prophets. Understanding the Jewish faith, which has a rich heritage of law, culture, and tradition, requires knowledge of its paths. Judaism's way of prayer. So Ju Jews prayed three times a day, first in the morning, afternoon, and the evening. So Jewish prayers tied as the concept of sacrifice. So Jews recognize Sabbath, in which um, it takes about a day of rest and prayer for Jews. It begins at sunset on Friday and lasts until nightfall on Saturday. But most observant Jews celebrate Sabbath by attending Torah and also by attending a synagogue on a social, uh, social gatherings with the other Jews. Book of Judaism, which is the Siddur. Siddur is a term of Jewish prayer books containing a set order of daily prayers. The prayers and benediction of a Siddur break all testament sentiments of praise Thanksgiving, meditation, intercession, acknowledgement of sin, and prayers for forgiveness, and to express the religious feeling. This symbol is a symbol of Judaism. The Jews call this as the Star of David, or also known as the Shield of David. They consider that the Shield of David brings good luck. The top of the star represents the upward direction towards God. And the lower triangle symbolizes the real world that exists below. As we can see, the Star of David is all triangles intertwined, which represents that each and everything is inseparable and interrelated to each other. What is Christianity? Christianity is a monastic religion, meaning the adherents only believe in one God. The adherents of this religion is called Christians. Christian believes Jesus Christ, the only God, the second person in the Trinity. Hence, they believe the teaching of Jesus of Nazareth. Christianity has divine Godhead, consists of three parts. These are the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. praying. Christians. Christians do not face a certain way when they pray. They can pray facing any direction since God is omnipresent. While Christians do not pray in a physical direction, they do pray in spiritual direction. Bible our prayers directly addressed to God. We don't go wrong when we pray directly to God the Father. He is our creator and the one we should worship. Through Jesus, we have direct access to God. Book of Christianity Christianity has different types of books, such as Old Testament and New Testament. But the main book of Christianity is the Bible. The Bible tells the history of earth. The events happened during Christ's era and before Christ's era. About the symbol of Christianity. The symbol of Christianity is cross. The principal symbol of the Christian religion recalling the passion and death. The cross is thus a sign both of Christ himself and of the faith of the Christians. Cross remind us of the sacrifice that Jesus Christ made for our sins. The topic of Islam. What is Islam known for? Followers of Islam are called Muslims. Muslims are monotheistic and a worship one, all-knowing God, which in Arabic it is called Allah. Followers of Islam aim to live a life of complete submission to Allah. Islam teaches that all Allah word has revealed to the Prophet of Muhammad through the angel Gabriel. The five pillars. First, profession of faith. There is no God but Allah. 
and his messenger is Muhammad. This is the basic statement of Islamic faith. If anyone who can recite it wholeheartedly is not a Muslim. Second, prayer or salat. This is a ritual prayer of Muslims. They perform it five times daily in a set form. Third, alms or zakat. The obligation to donate a certain proportion of wealth each year to charitable causes. Fourth, fostering or song. They will practice abstaining, they didn't eat, they didn't drink, and no sexual activity. They will do it during Islamic holy month of Ramadan. It will observe between dawn and nightfall. Pilgrimage or Hajj. The pilgrimage to the holy city of Mecca in Saudi Arabia which every adult Muslim must make at least once of his or her lifetime. The symbol of Islam. This is the symbol of Islam, the crescent moon and the star. This star represent or this five pointed each of the star represent the five pillars of the Islam which are central to the faith. And, and this moon represent the guidance of God on the path through life and this crescent moon and star are symbols relating to the greatness of our creator okay. what is book of islam so the the book of islam is called the holy quran this is the example of the book of islam the holy quran it it contains the word of allah and his attributes of a man relationship with him and his followers so quran is gonna instructs muslim on how to behave and sets out what is right and wrong so i will be discussing the differences and similarities of the three religion judaism christianity and islam so i will start in judaism so judaism most of the believers of judaism is the jewish people and they be judaism believe that in they believe in one god Believe in individual and collective participation in an eternal dialogue with God through tradition, rituals, prayers, and ethical actions. They pray three times a day. Their book called Sidur contains the entire Jewish liturgy used on the ordinary Sabbath. Doctrines of Judaism is God exists. There is no other gods. Jews should only worship one God. And the symbol of Judaism is six-pointed star of David. So, Christianity. The differences of Christianity is belie Christianity believes that Jesus is the Son of God, believe in individual salvation from sin to receiving Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior. So, so ang tawag sa book of Christianity is Bible, contains of the state of man. And their doctrines is love your neighbor as yourself, forgive others who have wronged you, and the most important is the Ten Commandments. And the symbol of Christianity is cross of Islam. The Islam, they believe that Allah is God, is the creator of the universe. And Hasud Muhammad is the prophet of Allah. They believe that Allah sent many prophets for different time to teach people what is right and wrong. And um, Islam, they have five prayer times called Salat. Their book, called Quran contains sacred word of God intended to correct and errors. Their doctrines is Salat or prayer, Shahada or acceptance of Allah, alms or Zakat, fasting or Psalm, pilgrimage or Hajj, and the symbol of Islam is called Crescent and Star. Well, uh, the similarities of Judaism and Christianity is believe that God exists, God is creator of the universe. Believe in the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. And the uh, similarities of Judaism and Islam is two religions share similar values, guidelines, and principles. So uh, the similarities of Islam and Christianity is they believe that Satan is the real devil and both have prophets. Believe that prophets are chosen and called by God. And lastly, the simil similarities of these three reli religion, aside from monotheistic belief, have a great deal common similarities in notions of sacrifice, 
of and peace and in their faith or by praying their God or praise their God. That's all.